Hi, I'm Dr. Gerson, and if you're watching this video, then you must have got my email, which I sent through the Blackboard system, or you may have received it if I sent it to you through my CSU stand if you're on the waitlist. And so those are just some things to get you started. If you're on the waitlist, you're not going to be able to access our Blackboard site, but at least you'll have an idea of what we're going to be doing the first day of class. So let's see. I'm Dr. Marina Gerson. I'm a herpetologist. I've been on campus already for nine years at Stan State, so this is going to be my 10th year on campus, and I've taught general biology many, many times, and I'm doing things a little bit different this semester. We're going to have some videos on my YouTube channel, and you must have accessed the YouTube channel if you're watching this one right now. So hopefully there will be some tips, some pointers that will help you make connections between the lecture and the lab part of the course that will help to promote your success. So let's see what else you're going to need to do to be successful in the course. I'm going to go ahead and open a web browser. So I happen to be using Safari and you can see I'm here at Stan State, right? CSUStan.edu. I'm sure you've all been there by now. And notice there's always that big students tab that's on the left side of the web page there. So I click on students. And if you scroll down the page, there's lots of information. But what I want you to target right now is how to access our Blackboard site, because I'd like you to print our syllabus for the first day of class. So notice here the second link down in the series of tabs on the menu is going to be Blackboard. So I click on Blackboard and you'll notice here's a login box. So type in your word, your username, and your word, your password, and click login. And as you move forward, your Blackboard site might look a little bit different. I might have customized these colors, but I find the easiest way, especially once you've been on campus a while and have a lot of courses, the easiest way to find what you're looking for is click on Courses. And then you'll have a course list. You'll notice I have a lot of things on my list because I've taught a lot of different classes here. But what I'm looking for is 2014, and FL stands for Fall. And I'm looking for General Bio 1. And you'll notice that the 001 that's the section that's for our lecture. So I'm going to go ahead and click there. And when I do, it should come up and look like this. If you see this banner, then you know that you're at our Blackboard course. You'll notice that I'm going to be adding a lot of material to our Blackboard course over the semester. So on the left side of the screen, you see some tabs you can click on. The home page is where we are now. There's information and syllabus, assignments, preview review questions, and lecture PowerPoints. And I'll be adding content to each of these areas, but you can go ahead and explore them even now and see what's up there so far. But what I want you to do before the first day of class, if you can, is to click on Information and Syllabus. And when that tab opens, you'll see that there's some quick information about where the course meets and what days the labs are on. If you ever miss a lab, you might want to see, well, could I maybe attend a later lab in the week? And who's the instructor that I need to contact to ask them for permission? And then notice that the second area of content here is the syllabus. And so right now you can download the syllabus as a PDF or as a Word document. I recommend the PDF unless there's some reason you need the Word document. And then there's also a quick view of the syllabus. If you're just looking for the course outline or just looking for where the points come from, then you're able to just glance at those while you're on the Blackboard site. So for our first day of class on Friday, I'm hoping that most people in the class will have a chance to click to open the PDF version of the syllabus. And you can view it right there on your screen. You'll notice I think it's six pages long, so a few pages, a lot of information on the syllabus. And to download, usually if you just hover towards the bottom of your screen, then you can click on download. And then you have a copy of that saved to your computer. And so my hope is that everybody who's currently enrolled in the class will be able to download and then print out a copy of the syllabus before the first day of class. But don't worry if for some reason your printer's out of ink or you run out of paper or you can't find the computer lab on campus to do your printing before you come to class, I will have some copies ready for you. So if most people bring a copy, then we'll be ready to do our syllabus exercise on the first day of class. And I'll look forward to seeing you there.